Yeah, man, crazy day. Crazy day yesterday. Man, we were uh, nine hours, almost a little over nine hours at the shipper, picking up at Advance, North Carolina. We got to the shipper last night, or last night. <laughs> we got to the shipper yesterday morning, say about 10 30, 11 o'clock. And uh, yeah, usually just a simple drop and hook. And uh, this time, this is the second time I've been to this place. Yeah, and this is the second time this happened. The last time it was like three or four hours. This time I had to do like an eight hour break just to get some time back. And we didn't actually leave there till, man, seven ish, around there somewhere. We drove, got our time back that we lost. We got about six hours back. And so then we, uh, we drove and we got to South Carolina here at about, I don't know, 1, one o'clock in the morning, 1.30ish, around there somewhere. Thank goodness for Daniel calling me. <laughs> he called me last night. I was getting tired. He got me down the road, so I appreciate that, buddy. Got me down the road a couple hours. And we got about 400 or so miles. I don't know how much longer do we have left. 416, Brandon, Florida. We're gonna get this thing delivered. Looks like we're gonna go home for the night, so that's good stuff. So we got a pre-assign after this. We're supposed to pick up like Fernando Beach. That's like way up like past Jacksonville and stuff. So a little bit of a deadhead, but it's a straight shot, so it ain't too bad. So at least we get to go home for the night, so that's good. So but once we get rolling, I'm waiting for my time to come back. I got like five minutes left. Start. I already did my pre-trip and everything, so we're ready to go. Just got to key in the pre-trip, and we're going to get to Jacksonville. It's about a little over 200 miles. Get a little bit of fuel at the Loves. Get a shower, so at least we come home clean and refreshed. <laughs> I think the uh, your significant others will appreciate you coming home smelling nice and clean and not like this after a couple days of no shower, so after being in the hot sun and everything so we'll get a shower get delivered get picked you know grab us an empty and head to the house so first but first yeah yeah coffee the fresh brew flying j coffee you want to go home tonight Oh, she's ecstatic. <laughs> I'm ready to get home, so let's get this day started. Alright, we are I-95 South. Coming up here to Georgia, crossing into Georgia from South Carolina. trying to see if we can make it home tonight. That'd be great. Let's see if they pull us into the way station. If not, keep on cruising to Florida.
on going. Let's get to Florida. We've got 120 miles to Jacksonville. Shower time. Yeah. Check this out. So so we're driving. Look at this. Whoa. <laughs> My wiper just flew off, man. So I uh golly man. So we're gonna I think I got an extra one back up, so I gotta change swap out this wiper really quick. Golly man, hold on. Wait for some of this traffic to get by. Here we go! up wiper blade yeah and it's not the best but it'll, it'll get me down the road we can get some extra get another set now let's see if we can get back on 95 Maybe not. Come on, people. I don't know if anyone's going to let me over. Could be one of those just come on over. There we go.
sure tell the uh, terrain changes Georgia to Florida like the last 20 or 30 miles man it just started to become like I don't want to say like swamp land but like Everglades type area you know with them tomorrow morning. We gotta go all the way back to Jacksonville for a pickup. But from home, we made it. All the way from advanced North Carolina. Okay, okay, okay. I know where I'm going from here. We got it, we got it, we got it. We got it. We got it. Let me uh, get on out of here before she starts talking again. Oh. Now we're going to finish it up here. I'm about two miles from the house. Talk to you guys next time and see where we go and what's going on. Thanks for watching. Catch you guys next time.